Air Force Tech Sergeant Ian has deployed for six months multiple times. It's never easy on his family, but now he deploys for a year. Megan must shoulder the responsibilities of both mom and dad while he's gone. I know that she can do it. She actually is the perfect military <laughs> spouse. I have no doubt if there's an issue, and we have a good network of friends, family, she can call, and uh, she's taking care of. I know that that lifts the burden off of him to be able to leave, knowing that uh, I have it taken care of. To prepare for this year's separation, they decided Megan should leave her part-time job at a grocery store to be at home full-time with the boys. The $5,000 cut to their budget will be missed, but necessary. If somebody got sick or the school closed down or we had to go remote, um, I would have to call in and say I couldn't be there. So I was hanging on to something that was going to end up being I was going to have to quit anyways. At the halfway point, Ian is allowed three weeks of leave. However, the family is responsible for the cost of the flight home. If it puts us in a financial bind, it, we won't put ourselves in that situation. Despite the financial and emotional challenges this year may bring, they know God will see them through. My faith and my prayers will absolutely play a role in, a huge role in getting through Near Ian's duty station at Seymour Johnson Joint Military Base, North Carolina, is their church home, The Lord's Table. The church asked helping the home front to get involved. Pastor Ken Jefferson told the couple CBN was offsetting their loss of income that Megan brought in from her part-time job. No way. Serious? <laughs> Might do it. I ain't crying. <laughs> so that's just the beginning, helping the home front and their partners want to make sure that it isn't money that keeps you apart for a year. And so they're going to cover your ticket home at your midway point. Make sure that you're able to come home, spend some time with your family. It really is amazing because we really would not have had him come home if we couldn't do it. So that, that's amazing because that's the best gift that we could have. The first week of January 2021, Ian shipped out. This family is now looking forward to his visit home this summer. Thank you to the CBN partners for this incredible blessing. I don't think a thank you is, is even enough. It's great. It's awesome. I, I, I don't even know what to say. Thank you, everyone, everyone on the team.